Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Yet yeah, once again, it's your girl Miss Kiki Style, aka Natural Hair Key, aka Houston. It is, aka now about to be the dating talk show host or something. I don't know. Anyways, we are here today because y'all want to talk about dating. Let's talk about it. The dating scene has turned into a crime scene. I said what I said and I'm putting a stamp on it okay so y'all want to talk about dating no this thing is just down too far let's talk about dating y'all dating in 2023 has been crazy for me okay I'm talking for real. So let me just tell y'all. Dating. Let's 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 just start with me personally. Dating me is not hard, but it's also not easy. It's just it is what it is. I am who I am. And it's just, it is what it is. You know, there's not really much explaining. Um, but let me just say, I have met some of the nicest, sweetest people ever. I have also met some of the craziest guys ever. Like, it's just from zero to a could have been hero or a potential hero like it's just it's crazy you know i'm the type of person where i know what i want i know what i want and it's like if i can't get that then it's like bye bye you know, deuces, I'm gone, I'm out. I have settled for less. I have set myself up for failure. You know, and I'm only human, we're all human. You know, we make mistakes and I always say this, you live and you learn from it. Still learning today, still learning, still learning, okay? not perfect so dating in 2023 has just been a mess it's been a mess you know again i know what i want so it's like if i don't see that within a certain amount of time span it's kind of like i feel like i'm wasting my time and guys always ask me what it is that i want and, you know, Steve Harvey once said that you're not, I don't know exactly how he said it, but it's something to this effect. Never tell a guy exactly what you want because they're going to put up this persona of being that guy that you want. And in all actuality, that's not the guy that he is, if, if you understand what I'm saying. So basically, it's like you're meeting his, um, what, I forgot what they call it. Oh, this is going to bother me too. You're meeting the, um, their agent. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like you're meeting, it's a fake, it's a phony basically. So they're, that's not exactly who that person is they're trying to be this so that they can reel you in if that makes sense is what i'm trying to say so it's like okay they're trying to be this person that you want them to be so that they can reel you in and it's like no that can't be you and i'm peeping game but you don't know i'm peeping game but i'm peeping game and i'm like no <laughs> can't be 
be real. It's, this is not real. This is not life. Oh my God. Like, it's just, it's too much. Okay. Anyways. Okay. So you're meeting his representative. That's the word. You're not meeting him. You're meeting his representative. So he's acting like this is who he really is, but then that's not really who he is. So eventually he'll, you know, be like, you know what? Forget what she wants. This is who I am. Either she gonna accept me or she not, sort of thing. And it's like, nah, mm -mm, ain't doing it. But anyways, so like I said, it's just been like really, really crazy. You know, I've met some really nice guys, but then it's just like, oh, he's not really my type, you know, or oh, I can't really see myself dating him, you know, or mm, it's just a no for me, you know. And then I've met some um guys that i really really like you know and it's just like we're not on the same page like they don't want what i want does that make any sense it's like okay so i know what i want right and i can tell you guys a few things hopefully he's not watching this video but anyways like i know i want marriage i know i want a family i know i eventually want to get a house you know i eventually want to have my own business you know these are just a few things right and so whoever that guy is that i uh plan to potentially date i'm wanting him to kind of want some of the same things that i want so it's like okay i know eventually i want to get a house i want to meet someone or at least be with someone that eventually wants to get a house or you know may even already have a house and can uh, help me get my own house or I mean, I don't know. Maybe we can move it. I can move in with him and we can make it our own or we can I don't know um, Whatever, I'm not saying shacking up or anything like that. I'm just saying like, okay, I know I want to get a house, right? So Whoever this guy is He's gonna want that too. Or if not, I can probably persuade him into wanting that, you know So it's like, okay I know that I want to be successful in life. So I would want to date someone that also wants to be successful in life. You know, and I'm not saying that um, this person just has to want everything that I want because I don't think that's even possible. But at least somebody that is, you know, on the same page that I'm on. And it's like, I just have not met that person you know and i'm i'm more certain that no one actually meets you know that perfect person like you know and us as women we have this list you know we have these crazy thoughts you know like it's like i don't want to date a unicorn you know i want to date a a prince you know i want to date somebody that is you know wanting every single thing that i want or you know is gonna have everything on this list like oh he he got this 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 he got everything wow you know and i'm looking at my list like this is the guy <laughs> where did you come from sort of thing so i know it's not gonna be like that you know and i had a conversation with a friend in, in the past you know and she stated Kiki, you're not going to meet this guy that is going to have every single thing that you want. So think about, you know, your top three things or your top five things that you want in a man. And, you know, have that list, you know, and you go from there. If that guy has that top three things or that top five things, you can actually work, you know, that. So my thing is this. This is a big, 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 big deal breaker for me. I don't know what God has in store for me, honestly, but God knows my heart and God knows what I want and God knows what I deserve. So if I am trying to do things the right way, if I tell myself I want to be married and I want to have a child or two, whoever... I plan to date or get in a relationship with that person is going to have to want marriage and a child you know or a family 
you know, if that person has their own child, that's fine. You know, I can kind of work with that. That's a family, right? But I want marriage. So if that person does not want marriage, then I know that person is just not for me. I just, I talk with my hands so much. Like, I should just start doing this. <laughs> but no, seriously, like, it's been crazy. So I've met a guy that... I really, 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 really deeply, deeply, deeply liked, you know, and it's like that guy does not have the same mindset that I have, <laughs> like, you know, so it just comes a point in time where you just got to let it go, you know, let that person go move on move forward and i'm not saying hop on to the next person but you know you gotta find that person that is for you and so i'm also this type of person like i don't want to waste anyone's time i just i don't want to and i can't fake like somebody like it's just never been in me like and i'm not a user either like my intentions are always good I have good intentions. I have a good heart. You know, I got a good head on my shoulders. So it's like, if that person is like not on the same level as I am, or if I'm not physically attracted to that person, or if, you know, things are just, not there then i'm i'm not gonna waste your time you know and i just i just might ease back a little bit you know i'm just like oh i cannot do it like i cannot do it and you know i feel like at some point in my life you know i said i would um settle I told myself, I said, well, maybe, you know, I just won't find that what I'm looking for. And so I told myself that I would just settle. How crazy could that be? But people do it every single day. But I just told myself, you know what? That would be so stupid. Serving a God that I serve, like I know God has something in store for me. It's just by faith. You know, it's by fate. Like, I know it. Like, it's coming soon. I just need to be patient. <laughs> right? So, again, it's been crazy, y'all. It's been hard out here for a pimp. It's been hard. But no, seriously, guys, yeah, it's just like dating in 2023 i don't know and then it's like i just don't understand certain guys these days like they reel you in in the beginning you know they get you exactly where they want you you know and then they start acting different you know and it's just like bro when i first met you you wasn't acting like this now you acting a little weird why are you acting weird to me <laughs> why <laughs> what did i do but anyways yeah so that is pretty much it for this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. You know what? I need a wand so I can. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. I have more videos on the way. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. I will see you in my next video.